Hello everybody and welcome to the 13th day of our Redstone Advent Calendar. Counting down the days towards Christmas with some bite-sized redstone. And what I got for you here is a fantastic little contraption. It is the Water Descender. Now this is no new concept, it's something that you've probably seen before. However, with this design I've made it extremely easy to use and easy to build as well. So the idea is, if you want to go downwards, let's say in your base, and you don't want to build a ladder or a piston elevator, you don't want a pool of water at the bottom to drop into, then this Water Descender can temporarily create some water for the player to fall down in and make their way safely down below. And the way that you use this one is extremely simple. Just hold down forward, then let go, and you're going down in the water. As you can see right here, we are safely making our way down. Now, one thing that I want to point out there is that I didn't have to hold down spacebar or anything like that to stay in the water. All I had to do was walk forward, which is why this design, I think, is uh, really, really good. So, if you remember the ninth day of our Redstone Advent Calendar, we did the Slime Block Piston Bud. We're using that thing again right here, and we're using it to detect when we walk over this string. So that can then activate some redstone, which is going to open the trapdoor for us to fall down through. And it's also going to activate that dispenser down there twice, so that it can dispense some water and retract it again as well. And with the right timing, it means that we get to sit in the water without needing to hold down spacebar or anything like that. And that's why I really like this contraption. So you'll need some space in which to build this contraption. This thing is three blocks wide and seven blocks deep, which is a nice little footprint for a contraption like this. You can see this space is where you're gonna drop down at the front in the middle. And then I've also marked a couple of blocks here because that one's got a piece of redstone on and this one over here um, has a repeater. So this thing is going to be two blocks tall to the floor. So this is the height of the floor. That's the bit where you fall down and then it's an additional two blocks taller than that. So make sure you've got the right amount of space and this is positioned in the uh, correct area and then you'll need these materials to build it. So we've got our dispenser with the water, redstone block, two slime blocks, a sticky piston, six pieces of redstone, four repeaters, a furnace or other type of immovable block and then we need the fence gate and the string. So we'll start off with a block to the left of the redstone, put a dispenser in front of it facing forwards, of course in there is where your bucket of water is going to go, and then blocks all around, also a block over here that's got a repeater on top of it, you want a block either side of that as well. Then behind it, three blocks with redstone on top of it. The other side of this repeater, we need a block with redstone on, and then we need a block to the side of that, another one down here, and then one on top of that piece of redstone, and then put a repeater facing into that block. Now we're going to put a block in front of the dispenser, put the fence gate on top and then the string on top of that. Then we'll remove that block and place blocks around it like so. This is the platform for walking onto this thing. Then behind it we're going to have a sticky piston and surround this in blocks as well. So five in total and then we're going to put two slime blocks back here, a redstone block on top, a furnace to the side with a piece of redstone on top of it. Then a repeater pointing out of it onto a block that we will place above this redstone. And now this thing is ready to go. So that's how you build the water descender and another thing to consider is where the water lands. If it hits the ground it's going to spread out so either have a gap in the ground like so or put some slabs around the outside. And that is how you build the water descender. Do hope you have enjoyed the video. If you have leave a like and of course be sure to check out Mumbo's Redstone Advent Calendar video as well. But that's it from me so thank you for watching and I'll catch you next time. Bye bye.